How many of you feel like uh, the world is changing too fast? Anybody? <laughs> well, if you think the world is changing too fast today, I've got bad news. It's going to change faster tomorrow. Here's the deal. And here's the good news for us, I think. The world is changing fast, but the laws of behavior remain the same. Now, Doc Sunberg was referring often to a book that was written over 50 years ago, right? Ivar Lovas, when I met him, he talked about, he says, to the audience, he says, uh, the principles of behavior are relatively well understood. This was 1966. And so if you knew them then, guess what? You know them now. There's not a day goes by in our office that I don't have to ask a younger person how to do something. <laughs> but in matters of behavior, guess what? They still come to me. Not necessarily to me, but other people, older people in the office. Because they've learned something about human behavior that will never go out of stop. It's not that we, keep, that we know everything. There's still a lot to learn. But the basic principle that we know, that we learn, are going to be here for a long time. We learn from our environment. When do you think that's going to change? And so what I tell our customers is, if you know about behavior, then you, your job is secure. I'm a big fan of Eric Stevens' art program. And basically what this says is the behavior goes to the most reinforcing part of the environment. I read an article, I think, just yesterday, the day before, about some guy has got something on the web. He's talking about how uh, distractibility is a, a brain thing. In other words, this is something you can't really control. We're, we're, we're designed to be distracted. Well, we know how to change that, right? <coughs> she said, I wrong. Um, what's the, what was the they? Positive reinforcement. And, and uh, the, the, the magic law demonstrates that over and over again. That if we put more reinforcement on A than there is in any other part of the environment, guess what? People focus on A. If you, if you take a teenager with a, with a video game, are they distractible? Do they know somebody's around? Do they hear you call them for dinner? No. Well, how many reinforcements do you think they're getting? It's about, uh, it's around 200 a minute. What part of work, what part of school produces 200 reinforcements a minute? <laughs> Thank you. 